Welcome back, you guys. This is Tessindra. Continuing my Hoi 4 Kaiserreich campaign as Argentina. Now, I'm gonna put it on speed 4 and unpause right from the start. Um, we're hoping to do some damage to America right now. I did take a look at the world in the pause here. Uh, right before I started recording, that is. And they are running very low on manpower. They do. They did have so many divisions. I don't know if they just deleted them or if they got stack wiped. I mean, I did not stack wipe anything, so... Maybe when one of his allies fell, he was um, he had some troops there that got stuck and then wiped out? I don't know. But if we take a look at Canada right now... Yeah, the Russian Empire is probably going to fall very, very soon. And uh, Portugal is pretty much just fallen. It's basically just the capital left there. And moving into England, we do have the Shetland Islands and the Orkneys. That is the only thing left alive for England. And they do still have a navy strong enough to fuck up my supply lines. Or did they just stop trading with me? They just stopped trading with me. Oh no, they're using the steel for themselves. Okay. Let's do this. And... Um, so, your combat strength is sh really, really low. What's going on there? It's just taking a while to get there? Do I need to fix some infrastructure issues? Uh, if I take a look at this... You have to take a really, really long route over here. Do I just beef you up? What is the infrastructure in this province? It's three. Battleship 4 is done. I'm gonna beef up... Yeah, they take both the provinces, actually. This has been split in two, but I'm gonna build it in both. Let's see if that is enough. So that was the battleship finishing. Okay, so we got Battleship 4 and Light Cruiser 4. That's very, very nice. I'm kind of tempted to grab the Battle Cruiser. Um, they are quite good, but they take a long time to build. 8,000 production cost. What is the light cruiser? It's half, so I could get two light cruisers instead of one of these. I'm just going to unlock it. Fuck it. I mean, why not? Uh, let's see here. This is... I can actually upgrade this into a battleship 4. So we're going to go from battleship 2 up to a battleship 4. That is amazing. Okay, I'm fine with that. Okay, so we have not pushed here at all. Why are some of you not getting any supplies? No, no, no. Uh, you're in the queue, but it's taking a while to get to you? It's just infantry equipment, right? I actually don't know. what it is. What is it you lack? You lack quite a bit of everything there. Motorized, support equipment, light tanks. I don't know exactly why you're this weak. Is it that the supply ships have been going along the uh, the Caribbean and gotten sunk? Is that it? So my navy is almost repaired. It's going to be in April, it says. The 1st of April. I'm not sure if it's going to make it. I'm going to put it on speed 5. So as soon as this is done, they're going to go back into the Caribbean and try to cause some shit there. If they succeed, we're going to move them into these other t uh, sea, sa sea zones and see what we can do. So this invasion is getting thwarted here. You guys are not unaggressive. Um, that's fine, that's fine. They will take it back eventually, right? I still got a cold, by the way. I don't know if you can tell from my voice, but uh, it's been horrible. Um, so, what I would like to do... I'm going to push into this tile. But you're quite weak, actually. It will arrive in 120 hours? You're doing them in small batches? Why aren't you just resupplying everything? Ah, we're running low on manpower. Um, do we scale this up? 
If we do service by requirement, we start getting penalties to our uh, construction dockyard output. And uh, yeah, but I think we have to. If we want to win against uh, America here. So this is just infrastructure. This is tungsten. Oil infrastructure. This air bases. I suppose I could start going for that, but... <sighs> National spirit. Air base construction speed. Anti-air construction speed. No, but don't give a fuck about that. We get some anti- We get some AA guns. No. We get strategic bombers. Well, I'm not gonna use strategic bombers, so I might as well grab the AA guns. Air experience. Fighter focus. Close air support. Air doctrine. Air research time. Paratroopers and... Ooh. We gain war support from this. I mean, it's more exciting than just repairing shit. Okay, we got landing craft unlocked. Let's get the last one here. Let's get advanced landing craft. Just in case we decide to conquer some stuff. Uh, we need to import a lot more steel. It would seem... We're getting everything from the French Kingdom, pretty much. That we need. Um. So. I'm gonna scale you up. Just scale all of you up here. We'll get some more steel, it's fine. I'm not concerned about the resources anymore. I am kinda concerned that my convoys are gonna run out if I'm doing too much trade. Okay, looks like you finally got your resupply. You guys attack into this, and you guys support. Okay? You should be easily... you should be able to take that. Quite easily. So they can pierce all of our divisions. So we don't get the armor bonus there. Um, should I add some more tanks to my motorized? I mean, they are just light tanks, but still. Uh, I could upgrade into medium tanks, but that's gonna take a while. Are we actually going to fail this? Oh, come on. Really? Alright, alright. Oh yeah, we're attacking, of course, a river. Um... Ah, that's a, that's a stupid thing to do. Um... Let's see, once you get your organization back, let's just push with you and have the other guys support them. Ah, uh, you guys actually took Kingston! I missed that! So my navy is back out, doing some harm there. So we took Kingston, but it's not enough to capitulate them. So that was the cruiser. What other boosts do I have left? Refinery, infantry weapons. Really? I have infantry weapons? Okay. We can unlock this in 68 days. Let's enable invade from Kingston all the way to here. Yeah. Get over there. I assign you all to this. And go as soon as you're ready. 14 days. If we can take this, we should be able to march all the way down all of these islands and hopefully capitulate the West Indies. Okay, let's have you push. There's only three guys there now. And two of them are malicious. This should be easy. But why do the militias also have anti-tank stuff? They don't. But they can actually pierce me? They just have anti-tank rifles and that's it? Actually, what's it called again? Um, infantry anti-tank. So this is enough for them to... Kill my light tanks? Man, light tanks suck in the late game. Man, they're so bad. <sighs> Nuclear reactor. Hello. Options, options. We could queue up, like, I don't know, a few of them. Where should we build them? Uh, let's get some boosts on this. 50%. 50, 50, 60. Yeah, so we're going to have five of them for now. We'll see what we can get done. I wish it would start ticking up right now. You actually failed? 
For fuck's sakes. Honestly, get over here. Fengtian government. Okay, that's fine. Um... Can I tell you guys, you're trying to do close air support. If I tell you to go here... Um... What if I just tell, like, you... No. Let's take half of you and all of you and just right-click into here. So it's not a support attack, it's actually all of six of them moving. And fine, I'll do a force attack as well. How about that? Come on! You got force attack. You can do this. Oh, they got mountain ears, but this is not a mountain. It is a marsh. Really? All of this is marshland? So between Houston and New Orleans, is that just like one big marsh? Actually, New Orleans is just a marsh. <laughs> There's no city there. It's just uh, swamp dollars. Interesting, interesting. Ah, I should not have laughed like that. Ah. Ah, I'm getting teary-eyed. My cold is has weird side effects. So all of these guys are cut off from supply. Let's have... Just push into this. Ooh, we got an event firing. Escuela de Aviación Militar de Argentina opening. Founded in, on August 10th, 1912, under the administration of Roque... Rook? Yeah, whatever. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna butcher this no matter what, so... Uh, the Military Aviation School was created to accommodate the rising importance of aviation and to train and subsidize Argentinians' first generation of pilots. Due to the ever-increasing importance of aviation and its introduction in military warfare during the World Creek, expansions were agreed upon in 1934 to build a new headquarters for our aeronautical school. Located on the outskirts of Cordoba, the school is destined to educate the next generation of pilots and give us an edge over our neighbors. Our neighbors uh, are already dead. Uh, I don't need, think I need this. I'm just going to get the air experience. Actually, we're capped on that. Crap. So we scale up the fighter some more. Get Mark II fighters. Hmm. Yeah, why not? And tactical bombers as well. So the reliability does not matter at all here. So if I click this up, it goes over 100%. We don't really need that. Let's put the engine at 5. I hate that sound. And now we need a whole bunch of chromium. I'm guessing that's because of my battleships. Fours, yeah. And the light cruisers actually require that as well. So who can I trade with here? Cuba. We can trade with Cuba. Cuba is quite close to us. And this attack just is not going to work, is it? That is just ridiculous. Why is it not working? So you guys took this. Can you take this? Let's see how it works. Ah, I gotta blow my nose. God damn it. Let's see if I can do it without blowing out your ears. Ooh, our ideology. Yes, excellent. I'll take this. We're up to 86%. That is quite nice. So, St. Martin, I imagine that's supposed to be, is about to fall. And is that the end of the West Indies? And then I tell you to just run down here and then go into this island when you're done. Yeah. Oh, the island is split in two? Okay, that's fine. Just take it. Just take it and that will be the end of the West Indies. And this push here by the enemy is pretty much just dead. I don't understand how they're still alive. They should be out of supplies. They can't recover organization. They technically do have a city over there. I don't know if they can get some supplies from that. It's not their city. And they're actually counterattacking into us. What a bunch of morons. So there are 19 dudes assigned to this and one down here. Here we go. Let's give you an order to take back Belem. 
And tell you guys to go. Yeah. So, we took uh, the capital here of the West Indies. Now the port of Spain is the capital of uh, the West Indies. They are pretty much dead, 92% towards capitulation. They've taken half a million casualties. Most of it is to us. I quite like that. Well, they've been suiciding into us for a while now, so that's not that surprising. Uh-huh. Actually, what if I just scale you guys... No, wrong one. Like, across the river like this. Yeah. Just try to wipe out those pockets and then move on. Okay? Just keep pushing. They don't have time to entrench. And you take no crossing penalty, do you? A small one. I don't know why, though. I can tell you to stop. Just get a planning bonus to go here. Get an office plan going. Okay, so this push has not been going at all here. Just please, I'm begging you. Take this fucking province. Force attack. There is no way in hell you guys are this weak. It took me a while to build you, and now you're completely useless. Uh, I can add logistics to you, I suppose, and some field hospitals. Support equipment is fine. Yeah, we'll do that. Let's see what happens to you then. Ooh, are we gonna grab it? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, why hasn't um, Russia capitulated yet? Why are they still alive? Let's see, Russia. Service by requirements. They've still got more than half a million people there. So they're fine. They are absolutely fine there. Okay. So we're going to kick these seven guys out of here and they're going to move into this one tiny zone. And after that, they're pretty much toast. We're low on supplies. We're not getting our supplies from... Deutsch Ostasium. We gotta scale this down. Yeah. People are starting to use their own supplies now. So they're stopped trading with me. Or they're scaling down the trade at least. Come on, just take the fucking zone. I'm begging you here. We wanna get to New Orleans. I don't wanna have to wait until I get nukes. And the port of Spain is not falling. Go, go, go. Republican Air Force. Okay, uh, fighter focus. Uh huh. We do have a lot of army experience. I mean, I could tweak my uh, light tank to have some more armor. Is that gonna help? It's gonna help somewhat, but, like, is it gonna be enough? Why can I not convert from stockpile? None of these. Bullshit. I call bullshit on that. And now you're actually failing this. No, 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 no. Keep up the attack. Greece has capitulated. So finally, the Austrians have capitulated Greece. It took them a while to do. But there are no more targets for Austria to conquer. I mean, they can take Crete and Cyprus. And after that, that's, that's it. I mean, unless they can help in uh, North America, I think they're just going to stand there and do nothing. Oh well. Oh well. And why aren't they trying to grab uh, the capital here of Bukhara? If you grab it, that's it. Russia is dead then. Oh, they're pushing into us. Why would they do that? It's going to cause them a lot of casualties. I, 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 I like it. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to counterattack now. Yeah, you idiots. You're no longer entrenched. Why would you push against me? You idiots! You had a perfect entrenchment over there. <laughs> oh, man. That was stupid of them. So, uh, balanced. Yeah, just keep going. Synthetic oil experiments. Okay, we got it unlocked, but I'm not going to use it. Let's get medium tanks, see if we can get that done. Six days, that's it. 
and then we can swap from light tanks completely to stop building them. We got 3,000 supply of them. So I'm just going to completely stop this production of light tanks and move into medium tanks. Uh-huh. Let's see here. Are you ready to push? Some of you are green, but that's fine. So they're going to start shifting towards the western border now to help reinforce it. Getting rid of their entrenchment bonus. Oh, they're attacking. Let's do a uh, last stand. Oh, we don't have enough points. No, they're going to push us out. You bastards. So Dallas has fallen. Fuck. I mean, there's 24 of you. You're not holding that many places. That's all of you here. Ah, uh, stop pushing into Dallas. Okay, you know what? Fall back. Let them take that. So, the purple guy is really, really much weaker than the other general. Yeah, he's got no fucking defense or attack. So. Can I send you some help? Actually, it's better if I just attack into your... The, the guys that are trying to t attack you. That way they can't move in no matter what. Yeah, let's just take this back. This is looking fine. There's the floating airfield. And now I can get the, the last one there. Grand Battle Fleet. Beautiful. Um, I don't know exactly what to take here. Let's take the shovels. And let's call it a day, shall we? Uh, we did not push that far into America today, unfortunately. But we have been dominating the Caribbean for a while now. Our main fleet is just holding this. What do we have right now? We've got 50%. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take these two tiles as well. And then we'll see if we can sink some of those New England troops. Like once we move into uh, New Orleans. Actually, we don't need this one. We can actually do like this. Yeah, we can skip the Gulf of Mexico. Perfect, perfect. Okay, so I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then, see you. And thanks for watching.